This is Stephen Kennard, and you're watching GR News. Boys Festas and Happy Holidays from Stephen Kennard with the GR News team. Here are your headlines. Spider-Man PS4's downgrade controversy. Things began to spill over on Twitter when someone who purchased Spider-Man for PS4 noticed that a section of game identical to the early footage of the game had significantly less puddles in it. Yes, puddles. This unsatisfied customer did not stop there and went to Twitter with side-by-side -side comparison pics showing, folks, you got it, the less puddles existing. Now this quickly spun out of control and was dubbed Puddlegate. <sighs> you know, Insomniac Games, the developer of Spider-Man for PS4, responded on Twitter. Here's James Stevenson of Insomniac Games who responded. I am telling you, I talked to the technical and engineering and art staff and looked at the live code of this from the original build. There is no downgrade. Once the initial complaint tweet went viral, many copycat sleuths started posting their own flimsier downgrade accusations which ballooned into the actual game developers having to publicly defend themselves for, yes, puddles. Drinking in Disneyland. Thanks, Star Wars. In a galaxy far, far away, construction has begun on Disney's Star Wars Galaxy's Edge. Disneyland in California wants to give you the Star Wars experience, and it looks like we'll be toasting it up in Otis Canteen. 21 and over, of course. This will be the first time in 63 years that the park has sold alcohol, although members of an exclusive Club 33 at Disneyland's Norland Square has access to drinking in the Magic Kingdom. Disneyland spokesperson Liz Jager was quoted in an LA Times interview saying, Just as our theme parks have evolved since Disneyland opened, so have our guests' desires. Here's to hoping desires become reality. May the force be with you all in Disneyland's time of growth. For continuing information on these stories and more, like, comment, subscribe to Gamer Redefined. This has been Stephen Kennard on Labor Day with your GR News.